In this video, we will talk about power. Power is the amount of energy dissipated or generated per unit time. It's measured in watts, which actually means joules per second. In circuits, the power P is given by the current times the voltage across the device, that is P equals to I delta V. An important question to ask is, how can we tell if power is being generated or dissipated by a device? Again, sign conventions will be helpful here. Recall that we define the potential difference delta V like this. If you forgot about this, watch the previous video embedded in the card or in the description below. So by following this convention, positive power means power being dissipated. Negative power means power is being generated. In any circuit, power is always conserved, meaning there is no net creation nor destruction of energy by the circuit over time. This actually comes about from the law of energy conservation. The way that you can prove power conservation is to sum up powers of all the devices in the circuit, and they should give zero. We will show this with examples later on. Note that the powers here must possess the sign to specify whether the power is being generated or dissipated. Let's say we have this resistor here, where the two node voltages are given and the current through the resistor is known to be 5 amperes to the right. So to find power, we use the formula P equals to I delta V. We know that I is 5, and we have to find delta V. Recall that delta V is given by V start minus V end the node voltage where the current starts entering the device minus the node voltage where the current ends its journey through the device. So that means we get 5 times 8 minus 2 and this simplifies to give us 30 watts. Remember that this is positive 30 watts. So since it's positive, we consider this as 30 watts of power being dissipated. In the next video, we will begin on circuit analysis, which is where all the laws and conventions we have learned so far will be put to use to find node voltages and currents in each branch of the circuits. See you there.